Now, the African National Congress President Cyril Ramaphosa is expected to address the party's coalition partnerships workshop. This is the ANC is facing a tough future with coalition agreements strained and service delivery issues impacting its electoral support. ENCA reporter Pule Lechwiti Jones is following up on that story and joins me this morning. Pule, good morning to you and thank you so much for joining us. A, a coalition government in itself, I think, has been a headache, if nothing else, initially starting out as a marriage of convenience, but depending on the prop proportional representation and the vote uh, and which decisions can be made based on the numbers, it's just been a mess. Yeah, well, a very good morning. We've seen how, you know, coalition governments have turned out, particularly in the municipalities in Gauteng, where there's been a sense of uh, this functionality, especially in uh, the key metros such as the city of Johannesburg where there's been several mayors that have been changed as well. And then of course also in the city of Twane where we saw the ousting of the speaker and the mayor as well. So you get a sense that things haven't been as much as one would expect them to be. But at the core of this we understand that all of this is affecting service delivery as well. And these are things that uh, the ANC's local government workshop will be aiming to address. Uh, it started yesterday. We understand today will be the closing day. Um, and then there also we will get a, you know, a sense and of course a bit of a brief from the officials of the communication of the ANC department as to whether the president, Sir Ramaphosa, will be closing today or not. Um, but those are the kind of uh, talks that, that have been happening as well, whether is it convenient to stay in a coalition marriage that is not working. This is something the Secretary General of the organization, Figilin Balula, spoke about, said the party had to renew some of its coalition, um, you know, uh, criterias and, of course, policies as well to say that they cannot be in the coalition a government which does not, you know, suit parts, which does not work for the people as well. We've seen uh, the acting chairperson in the Kurleni also raising some of these issues saying that they cannot work with the EFF in that particular metro saying that some the, 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 the senior officials of the ANC had to look into this issue of the coalition marriage between themselves and the EFF in the Kurleni. Uh, but we're also looking at issues around which partners you necessarily choose. The kingmakers, it seems, the smaller parties and the ANC wanting to still maintain the dominance in the uh, key metros. We know that there's concerns around the 2024 elections uh, and your Limpopo, KZN and Eastern Cape, which one would have argued that they were the ANC's almost uh, strong base. But that is not a given anymore, is it? Well, look, what we're seeing is a very uh, a different pattern here. In fact, when the ANC and the EFF went into this alliance, we saw that in some of these municipalities, such as um, Ekurleni and Johannesburg, the ANC would either choose the speaker position or the chief of position and Mukhala City as well. Um, then the mayor would be the from the minority parties as well. And that, that has been an agreement that has been going on. But it seems as though this kind of marriage hasn't been fruitful. We've seen the kind of a public granting that has been done by both officials of the ANC uh, in terms of the Secretary General of the organization Figilin Balun and of course the EFF's party uh, Julius Malema as well. So there has been some bit of tension that has been going on amongst the two parties and of course this could affect uh, their coalition agreements but there's also been a lot of speculation around what will happen at the national level where some have um, speculated that there could be some sort of talk going on between the ANC and the DA as well as a result of the tension that's going on between the ANC and the EFF. So those are some of the things they will be discussing here at this workshop, um, particularly to see how do they strengthen their coalition agreements in some of the regions as well, in some of the provinces as well, to work for the organization, but also to ensure that service delivery is something which is prioritized within these coalition fronts. All right, Apule, thank you so much. Out in Birchwood in Ekuruleni uh, with that summit uh, taking place around the, uh, the survival, I suppose, of politi political parties in these coalitions and what that means for service delivery going forward.